The Smart Roads Plan ensures that decisions about the operation of the road network consider the effects on the surrounding community and the environment. While there will always be a need for building new roads, we must also better manage our existing road network. Under the plan, competing interests for limited road space are managed by giving priority to different transport modes at certain times of the day. All road users will continue to have access to all roads. However, certain routes will be managed to work better for cars and trucks, and others will be best suited for public transport, cyclists and pedestrians. The Smart Roads Plan sets out guiding principles for the priority use of arterial roads by transport mode, place of activity and time of day. Walking will be encouraged by facilitating good pedestrian access in activity centres in periods of high demand. Cars and trucks will be encouraged to use alternative routes around activity centres to reduce the level of through traffic. Trams will be given priority on key public transport routes that link activity centres during morning and afternoon peak periods. Buses will also be given priority on key public transport routes that link activity centres during morning and afternoon peak periods. Cycling will be encouraged by providing on-road and off-road bicycle facilities that separate cyclists from other transport modes. While trucks will have full access to the arterial road network, they will be given priority on important transport routes that link freight hubs and at times that reduce conflict with other transport modes. Changes to the operating of Melbourne's road network will occur gradually. There will be an increased emphasis on information technology with more effective use of intelligent traffic signals to allow extra time for trams and buses, fewer delays for pedestrians and improved coordination to assist with traffic flow. Freeway management systems including variable messages will better manage incidents on the freeway, while ramp metering will manage the demand of cars entering the freeway network to ensure the optimal level of traffic flow. Providing real-time traffic information to commuters via the internet or mobile phone will also help road users to make smarter travel choices.